out at the river tonight. We got a little cloud cover and I got two or three spots that I need to hit to see if there's a big brown out here. We did okay this weekend. When I say we, I don't necessarily mean me. My buddy Sean got a whopper of a Truckee River Brown and those fish are once, maybe twice a season if you're lucky. And he got his during summertime, which is not usually the time of year you get those big ones, but hey, that just gives me more fuel to, to want to get out and try to do it. But I'm gonna I'm gonna fish here for a little while and see if we can get uh, a good fish or two in the net. Good conditions. First cast. Always try to kind of work in a kind of a fan. Start close, move your way down, move your way closer to the bank. Try to just let this thing buzz in the current. See if you can entice one of these big fish to grab it. Most of the time I've been catching them though it's been farther down and you get, have to get the thing right underneath the bank. So you're you're risking your jerk bait. But that's what it takes to, to get a big fish. I'm willing to sacrifice a couple. Got one to pick it up way down there. Can't tell if it's good or not. But it was way down there. It was almost as soon as it hit the water. He's in the current, so... Gets, oh! Good fish. And it broke off, too. Oh, my good God. Well, that's fucking par for the course. What just happened there was... Your Dumbo buddy here. It's the disadvantage of fishing with uh, a little bit of weight on these jerk baits. Uh, sometimes they start sliding up and down the damn line, as you all know. And uh, when that happens, it kind of prompts you to want to squeeze those little split shots on your line a little bit harder. The problem with doing that is that sometimes you weaken the line and what just happened there, you get a good fish and he gets in the current, even with your drag set. They pull a little bit too much and it just busts right at the friggin' split shot and they take the jerk bait and the split shot. So somebody finds a 20 plus inch fucking river trout with a Rapala in its mouth. Oh, I just got nailed. Yes. Oh, he's a dinker. Just a dinker. Oh, got off. Uh, you can thank me for that because that's apparently what uh, <laughs> what I left this son bitch. He's gonna be dangling a a nice probably 8 inch section of sinker attached to jerk bait. No one grab it again. He's not big but uh just a little guy. I might let let him hop off. Well the luck has not been with me tonight. I just had another big old huge grab and I hooked him for one second, I go turn the camera on and whiff. Moseying on up the river. Damage ain't done yet. We gotta get a good one before we cut out of here. This one feels okay. Oh my god, he fucking flicked it. Not my night. It was a rainbow. I saw his pink tail. And fish in the current. Hadn't got one here in a while. Hopefully he got it good. I'm tired of losing shit. Ah, he's not big. I think he's just hooked weird. Yeah, he's just hooked weird. Can I catch a good fish here at some point? That'd be no. Yeah, that's a good 12-incher. That's what we got. <laughs> Not our 
better day for the big fish wanting to make it in the net, but hey, at least it's not a skunk day yet. Still got one more spot to hit before it gets dark. Anything can happen. All right, we're gonna hit uh, this last spot. See if we can't get a fish out, because honestly, it's been a pretty frustrating day. Rainbow. I don't think he's very big, but he jumped. Hopefully that was on video. Let's hope there's a bigger fish than that in here. Had to walk quite a ways down from the vehicle to get... Oh! <laughs> Holy not my night. There we go. This is a better fish. Oh yeah. This is a better fish. I think I got a decent hook set on that one, so I yanked once as soon as I felt him. Unless he's fouled. No, he's, he's okay. So take some line and do some stuff. Just get up here and let me get one in the net tonight. These fucking things have been Houdinis. It's like a bow. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with any okay fish right now. Got some energy. Yeah, I do got him in his mouth though. This is the first time tonight for anything. Well, I shouldn't say that. Yeah, he's not big, but he's maybe 17 inches. Good enough for this guy. Good fish, a little bit bigger than I thought. Right about 18 inches. Look at that song bitch, beautiful cup though. Get her going. One more. Got another one. Feels pretty good. Feels pretty good. Oh yeah. I don't know though. Hard to tell. Sometimes when you foul them and they only swing and you get them weird, they feel a lot bigger, especially in the current. Got your buddy over there next to the shoreline. Yeah, he's not that big, but uh, hey, another fish still. I don't know how much is going to be able to be visible when the, it's pretty dark out. I think it's another rainbow. Yeah, definitely another rainbow. That's another decent fish, about the same size as the last one. 18 inches maybe. Football-ish though. This one's definitely got a little bit more shape to him or her. Probably should have been a little bit more excited about this one. This is a better fish. She's fatter than fat. Big ol' rainbow. Right about almost 20 inches. She's fat. So yeah, I should be a little bit more excited about this. She just took a little bit longer to revive. That took uh, a couple minutes out of the, the trip to make sure she got off there. So she's out and back back in there to get even bigger. 
Well, not the worst ending to the night. That was a, a rough start to the night. But uh, landed two okay fish. Couldn't get any browns to want to do anything. But some nights are like that. Browns uh, are the most difficult ones to, to get to come out and, and do something. So I'm not going to beat myself up. And uh, the fact that there was two fish that were dumb enough to stay on the hook, apparently. Uh, that's a successful evening. I had a lot of work this week. It's going to probably take up most of my time, so I don't know how much fishing I'm going to get to do in the evenings, but I'm sure shit going to try to get out here and, and do some because the fish are biting. Till the next adventure, boys and girls. <laughs>